Okay, Linux Lite is now installed. Take out the USB and restart the computer. Okay, it's coming on. I see a mouse there. I see the time. It's making a connection to my Ethernet. Okay, the welcome screen comes on. scroll down and I'm going to install some software right here at the Linux LUT. My password. Yes. And searching for it right now. Okay, this screen is going to come, come up and you want to install software, push OK. But in the meantime, oh, no, there it is. I want to install two, two programs. Chromium and Kodi. So, do that, I push. Do you want to install both of them? Yes. Okay. Now to make this easier, the welcome screen. Okay, you can just type in welcome screen. And you can right click and add to favorites. See, it's right there. If you need it. Again. Right now it's installing. It's like Google Chrome, but it's Chromium browser. It's almost the same thing. And default is the uh, Firefox. So now in the terminal, you can type in G U F W which is the firewall and put our password in and then we'll see what comes up see there's the firewall installed and it's on already good you can go down here and you can just put in firewall and you can right click and you can add to the favorites or you can add it to your desktop. I want to add it there. See, it's at the desktop now. <clears throat> okay, while well, that's going on, you can right click, arrange des no, desktop settings go to the icons and you can check you got home and further on you got the trash see the trash there and if you want to change your wallpaper right here okay I'll close that off now it's still installing those two pieces of software, Kodi and Chromium. And wait till that's done. Okay, it says the packages were successfully installed. Okay, I just want to quit that. Over here, you got internet. Right click, add to desktop, which is the Chromium. And if you want to add the Firefox, add to desktop. See the right. Right up in there. You can pull them out and rearrange them whichever way. I want to put my trash on the top. 
this is all fine. Now in here, we can look for the Cody. Cody is in the multimedia. Right click, add to desktop. Okay, a little piece of software that'll clean up your caches. Just type in clean there. Let's see what comes up. Uh, light tweaks. Open up. Okay, and here you can remove pack. Well, you can just keep reading it. Okay, I'm going to click this one here. Uh, Firefox. Now uh, you can read all this here and see which ones you want to click off and that. But anyway, I'll just quickly show you. Begin. You put the password. Okay. Cleaning packages, eh? Yes. There. Done. Now, where do we find that here? Uh, recently used. Okay, I'm just going to pin it to the favorites. Okay, good for next time. So anyway, you can Google how to um, set up your uh, your Chromium web browser just like Google Chrome. And for the Kodi, you can uh, YouTube that. At, uh, the program for uh, movies and TV is Exodus. Uh, you can look on YouTube for that. I'll fire up the Cody once here. Okay, see Cody? It's coming up. But anyway, uh, that's what you tell you. Exodus. And to shut that off, this here is power off system. You just want to exit out of it. Okay, this is the last one I'm going to show you. I googled how to um, put a shutdown button on your desktop Linux, and this is what came up here. So, what you have to do here is you got to copy this, copy it, open the terminal, and paste it right in there push enter, oh, password, push enter, good, okay, now what you got to do is, you got to right click your desktop, create launcher, there it is there, you can name it uh, stop or shut down, whatever you want to do, uh, stop, um, no, um, what am I going to name it? Shutdown. Shutdown. And pull this up. And copy this right there. Copy it. And put it in the command. Paste it. Create. I'll minimize that. See what we got here. So you got it right there. Properties. Change this icon. It won't give you much to choose from here. I'll do that one there. Oh, it's not changing. Oh, there is one. Okay. Well, that's good enough. Now, when I click that, it should... Oh, I'll close this off here. And I click that on, it should shut the system off. Work executable, so it'll always do it. There we go. See, it's off. Thanks for watching.